making a day trip to the cabin. I'm kind of dreading it because the grass has not been cut since the end of May, Memorial Day. Um, I've been very busy. Got a different position at work. It's got me, uh, I'm, I'm actually, I'm working a lot more summer activities with the kids. <clears throat> uh, my, both my kids swim year-round. We've had meets and practice. And seems like uh, every weekend. And the way that the gas prices have been, I just haven't made a, as many trips down through the summer. But we'll go down here today. I'm going to spend the day, get the lot cleaned up, and hopefully be making more trips down, getting ready for the fall season. Uh, me and Dad are going to go to Ohio next weekend, get things prepped, get ready for the uh, Ohio deer season, uh, hunting camp at uh, the hunting camp, the house. Got stuff getting ready there for the West Virginia hunting season. So, a lot of stuff coming up. Just have been very busy this summer, but I just wanted to pop in, tell everybody hi, and uh, just going to do a day trip. So, if you want to, come on with me. Nothing too exciting today. Uh, be a lot of weed eating most of the day, but uh, it's always good to get down to the cabin, even if I'm working. So, come on with me. Okay guys, I just pulled up the cabin, look. Two fawns. Bedded. Underneath the cabin. This grass is, oh my goodness. I'm ashamed. But, it's kind of cool. That the, uh, there's a couple fawn. All right, I checked inside. Uh, everything's good to go inside. This is going to take a while. <laughs> um, this is probably the... I've had this piece of property since 2012. This is probably the highest it's ever been. So, go ahead and get the weed eater going. And uh, I'd say four or five hours job. But... Uh, at least it's kind of overcast. It's not too bad today. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, get my boots on and uh, see how many snakes I can find today. Well, I'm uh, three hours in and I'm about halfway done. I ran out of mixed gas. So I had to go down to my buddy's house uh, down the road here and ask if he had some that I could use. So it's about one o'clock. I got here about... Uh, 10 so keep on trucking I can't let this happen again this is uh, miserable well friends um, five hours later and I'm done it's not the best job but at least it's down but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get cleaned up a little bit and looks like a yellow jackets nest has got into the the bear yeah I'll try to take care of that before I leave My wife is deathly allergic to bee stings. So. There they are. It's a mama. They're getting some water. And the phone. She had three fawns. I don't know where the other two are. They're eating off this apple tree right here it's been dropping apples while I've been uh, weed eating so 
sure that's why they hang around right here. Cabin's looking good. No hot shower action today, guys. I'm gonna have to use the cool packs. Didn't bring my battery from my shower, but we'll be using the Duke Cannon show, uh, cold shower face and body wipes. These things are awesome. So looking at the journal and obviously looking through my YouTube, the uh, last time I was at the cabin was on 529-22 and that was Memorial Day weekend. So, <sighs> that seems like a long time ago. And by the looks of the grass, it was a long time ago. But, um... I'm going to go ahead and uh, scratch out today's uh, events in this journal and gather everything up and then head home. But I think we're going to stop down at the bridge and we'll see. I think Red Creek's kind of low, so we'll take a look at that before we leave. You guys can see Red Creek is pretty uh, pretty low compared to what it usually is. Yeah, not very, not much going on today. All right, guys. Well, thanks for coming along. Not, no, not too exciting, but um, you know, had to had to get it done. Had a window to do it, and that's just the way it is. Want to say hi to some guys out there, their channels, uh, Carl's Off the Grid, um, Crabby Bill, uh, To the Max Outdoors, J and J True Outdoor Adventures, and Three or Four Adventures. Just want to say hey, guys. Uh, I haven't been on YouTube too much actually either, but I try to get in there and, and watch your all stuff and, and all everybody else that, uh, that I interact with. Um, it's just very busy, so just bear with me. Uh, fall's coming. That's my more of my relaxed time, and uh, be able hopefully to be more interactive with everybody out there. But for for those of you that that subscribe to me, I truly appreciate it. I'm very grateful. But as always, guys, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next video. If you're ever just but coming out of Harmon and go to and you're on your way to Canaan, just past Bonner Mart Mountain Road is a little place called Camden's Corner Mart Gas and Groceries. I swear they have the best ice cream cones in the state.